It's all over. Meath have snatched this game. A case of daylight robbery because Louth had it. Louth should have won the game, but they haven't. They go to the referee, Martin Slodden, to ask him to consider his... Oh, this shouldn't happen. That is disgraceful. Well, this is outrageous, That actually. is disgraceful. Yeah, there's been an attack on the referee there. That's totally uncalled for. Disgraceful. They can argue all they want. The referee, in good faith, made his call. He went to his umpires. We've seen the benefit of replay. We know that the ball was thrown over the line at the end. Certainly it wasn't kicked, which it has to be. And the goal should not have stood. But this afternoon, Loud's attempt to win the Leinster title for the first time since 1957 has proved to be in vain. And there are still notes being taken. Peter Fitzpatrick is still talking with the referee. It's not going to count, however. Gardy required to come in and make sure that the referee can leave the venue safely. Yeah, it's an absolute shame that Loud lost this game. As I said, every player, every Loud player on that pitch emptied themselves today. The play to the skin, the play to win it, they deserve to win it. The decision oh, that's the end, disgraceful. This is that's all disgraceful. wrong. This is all wrong that the referee has been interfered with. And this is one of the reasons the GA have been saying we've got to keep fans off the field. They have no business no, being no. out there. And this is... This is thuggish, it's wrong, it I don't is. care what the result is. This is absolutely wrong what is happening to the referee. He gave a call in good faith, yeah. as you said. We don't agree with it here, we've had the benefit of a replay. But he, the referee does not deserve that. I haven't seen anything like that happen in a match here where we normally see such good sporting behaviour. That was outrageous. You can understand their anger and their frustration, but that kind of behaviour cannot be tolerated. And I'm sure the GAA will take serious action. But it's me who come in to celebrate a most unlikely victory. And they have won here in the end by a couple of points. There's a, a Moyer down there as well needing some attention. And it's uh, a very dramatic finale to an afternoon which on the whole was very sporting. And it will be remembered and should be remembered for a great game of football and not what happened immediately afterwards. Yes, and it was a fabulous game of football from both sides, but in particular from Loud. Loud were superb today, brilliantly prepared, very, very fit, great combined football. They kicked the game away, though. Let's kind of strip everything away. They had more chances than me during the game to actually win that game. Missed goal chances, missed freeze, missed points from plays. They should have been out of sight at the end. There should have been no cause for a disputed goal to decide this game. Well, it's leaving a lot of bitter, bitter memories. And in the end, at Croke Park, the 2010 Leinster GAA football final has been won by Meath. And they have won the title for the 20, 21st time. It's Meath, one goal and 12 points. Louth, one goal and 10.